Hello, I'm Di Roberts from the Insight School of Art and I'm going to show you a few little exercises to improve your art. I'm going to show you how to draw a caricature. Caricature, not sure how to pronounce it, but this is how it works. We exaggerate the parts of the face. Let me show you a very simple, cartoony face. A couple of eyes. Shaded in. A nose. A mouth. A couple of teeth. Cheeks. It's the sort of thing that a child would probably draw. A hairy chin. And a nice simple hairstyle. Right, the difference between that, which I would call a cartoon, and what I'm going to show you, which is a caricature, is that I'm going to take from a real person and I'm going to exaggerate their features. So I've got an image in mind. I'm drawing from life in a way, and I could do it from a model, and exaggerate the worst features. So I'm not making it up, I'm actually using a real person's um, shapes and exaggerating those slightly. Always put a twinkle in the eye, leave a little bit of light because it gives a feeling of life to the figure. The person who I'm drawing has got bags under their eyes, let's exaggerate them. A twinkle with the creases at the side, exaggerate them. Lines down the side of the mouth, exaggerate and a quite a large mouth that I'm going to make even larger. The reason I'm not showing you the photo is I don't want to be sued because sometimes in doing a caricature you do offend the person you're drawing. This guy's got a huge chin and a little bit of hair and all the time I'm exaggerating. He's actually got enormous ears as well so let's put them in understand why I don't want you to see the original photograph. Okay, very smooth hair and quite a small amount of hair because the chin needs to be emphasized. Let's emphasize it even more with a dip there and a little crease and he's got quite a wide neck and I can just put the collar in and indicate it around like that. That's it. That is a very simple way, exaggerating all the parts of the features, simplifying others, how to draw a caricature.